What is jellyfish? The word jellyfish is a common term used to describe animals that are made up of jelly-like material. Jellyfish are made almost entirely of water, about 95%. This sea animal belongs to a large group of animals called cnidarians. Cnidarians are one of the most common types of sea animals with more than 100,000 species. Jellyfish are invertebrates, which means they don't have backbones. Jellyfish are largely transparent, which helps them hide from predators that would like to eat them. Jellyfish are mostly made of a translucent gel-like substance called mesoglia. The top of a jellyfish is called the bell. Depending on the species of the jellyfish, they may have freely oral arms or long tentacles. Some jellyfish have light sensors called eye spots that can sense sunlight and help the jellyfish know which way is up. And some jellyfish are bioluminescent, which means that they can produce light from their bodies. Although no one knows for certain why they light up, it is believed to be a defense mechanism to startle a predator away or perhaps to attract other predator to eat their attacker. They also rely on thousands of venom containing stinging cells in their tentacles called nidocytes for protection and prey capture. Jellyfish tentacles contain most of the stinging cells, although some species have them on their belts too. Venom is ejected via nematocysts a whip-like hollow tubule which lies cooled under high osmotic pressure. When mechanical or chemical stimuli activate an external trigger, the lid of the cell pops open and seawater rushes in. This forces a microscopic barbed harpoon to shoot out and penetrate and inject venom into its victim. The Nematocyst discharge can occur in less than a millionth of a second, making it one of nature's fastest biomechanical processes. Nematocysts can continue to fire even after a jellyfish has died, so it's important to remove lingering tentacles stuck to the skin. Most jellyfish things are a painful nuisance, but some can be deadly. For example, an Indo-Pacific box jelly, also called a sea wasp, releases venom that can cause contraction of the heart muscles and rapid death in large doses. The largest species of jellyfish, the lion's main jellyfish, may reach a size of 7 feet or 2.3 meter across, with tentacles that can extend more than 121 feet or 37 meters, longer than a blue whale. The smallest jellyfish, the Irukanji jellyfish, may only reach about the size of your thumbnail. Despite its size, it's one of the most feared jellyfish in the world, capable of delivering a sting 100 times as potent as the of a cobra and 1,000 times as strong as a tarantula. There are many different types of jellyfish, including stinging kinds called medusa and non-stinging kinds called comb jellyfish or tenopores. Jellyfish also swim in a way that is very unlike how other sea creatures swim. Jellyfish use a simple type of jet propulsion to get around. They open their body like an umbrella and then close it. By contracting their body, the water inside is forced out and the jellyfish moves forward. Constantly moving is the only thing keeping jellyfish afloat. But even with this effort, they can easily be pushed around by strong winds or ocean currents, which is what leads some jellyfish to be washed up on beaches. Jellyfish are carnivores, but they don't hunt their prey. They wait for fish or other small animals to get caught in their tentacles. The tentacles cover in stinging cells, burst, and inject venom into their prey, paralyzing it. Jellyfish eat many different types of things, such as small plants, copepods, fish eggs, and other small fish called larvae. They also eat the planktonic eggs and young stages are called larvae of many different kinds of marine animals. Some jellyfish even eat other jellyfish. A study found that jellyfish would twitch and light up parts of their tentacle to lure fish in. Despite the impressive power in their tentacles, jellyfish are not invincible. Their stinging cells are no match for the armor of thick-skinned predators, such as the leatherback turtle and ocean sunfish. 
these predators boast of adaptations that prevent slippery jellyfish from escaping after they are engulfed. Jellyfish have a complex yet interesting life cycle. Usually, they begin as eggs, floating in the ocean currents. The eggs will then develop into planula, a swimming larval form. After a few days, the planula will find something sturdy to anchor itself to and undergo a transformation into a polyp. Polyps look a bit like underwater flowers, using their tentacles to catch and eat zooplankton. Eventually, the polyps begin to bud, splitting into an ephyra or immature jelly that looks like tiny flowers pulsating in the sea. Eventually, it grows and develops into a medusa, the form we usually recognize as a jellyfish. Despite all of the time it took to develop into a medusa, it usually only lives up to about a year. Distinctive and often beautiful, jellyfish may seem like calm and peaceful marine creatures. Although some types of jellyfish are harmless, others are dangerous predators that can prove painful or even deadly to those who venture too close. I hope you enjoyed learning about jellyfish. Goodbye, till next time!